Oh, what a lovely surprise to come home to. So I'm back at the apartment after a wonderful week at the lake. I got a little bit of post-vacation blues, but that's okay because I'm excited to get back into the swing of things. The rocketry team has been banging along on our summer project, which is a two-stage rocket. I'm about to head back to the garage and see what they've been up to, so I'm, uh, I'm really excited to see what kind of progress they've got going on. Dude, I like these aluminum fins. I almost want to keep them aluminum. Like, keep them bare. Yeah, that's what, that's what that's I was thinking about doing. This is second stage? This is the this, entire length of second this stage. This is the entire, as tall as the thigh fin. <laughs> like, this plus this is the entire length. Dude. Gnarly. All right, the boys are about to stand the, uh, the hydra up to give you guys a sense of scale of how big this sucker is going to be. It doesn't fit in the frame unless I'm all the way back here. Dude, that, is all, that almost doesn't fit in the garage. Dude, how, Dude, how where are you gonna put rail buttons, Justin? <laughs> I haven't gotten that far. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Will? Pretty big. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> when you look at the section, it's like, each individual section doesn't feel big, because you know what's going in each one. Yeah. And then when you look at it as a whole, you're like, that's insane. Like, this is just a booster, this is the second stage booster, that's just the payload section, that's recovery, and then those come, but like, looking at it all, it's like, what? So tall. The second stage is still bigger than a Predator. Is it, wait, the second stage is actually taller than the Predator? Oh, it looks like it. I almost want to get the Predator down. <laughs> like, put it next to it. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Do you want to get it down? There we go. It's worth it? Yeah. It's easy. It's just, you have to untie right. that, I'll tie that knot. I remember we thought that was big. Dude, it's almost two Predators. Perspective time for scale. There's the Predator, last summer's rocket, and then I have to go all the way back here. <laughs> and there's this summer's. All right, Justin, give the viewers some stats. What's this baby gonna do? How fast are we going? This is our uh, two-stage launch vehicle. Um, it'll be going about Mach 0.95, almost supersonic, so it'll be in the transonic regime. That'll be the fastest uh, velocity that it reaches. Um, it's pulling about 14.5 Gs. So it's got a lot of acceleration. Got some kick. All right, payload. What's the payload? Uh, the payload is a cold gas thruster precision altitude achieving payload. So it'll basically use cold gas thrusters, uh, um, th use nitrogen thrusters to thrust up and uh, achieve a precision altitude of whatever we're set for the next competition year. So why is it so big? It's a good question. This is a two-stage rocket. For the uninitiated, that means that this has two motors. So the first motor here will burn, and then when it is burned, it will drop off, and then the second motor lights, and then the rocket, well. I go, baby. What else do you think our audience needs to know? Actually, I think all they need to know for now is that it's gonna be sick and to stay tuned, right? It's gonna be fast and loud, so stay tuned, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> it's machine in time. <laughs> 